Hello everyone, so I have Zoya's Enamored um, Fall Collection of 2023. Enjoy! So first up we have Frenchie. It can be described as a warm beige pink cream. These are all amazingly beautiful and perfect for fall. Um, I can only imagine these in matte. Um, I'm gonna have a few designs coming up. I've already got them recorded and everything and believe me, matte in these shades, um, especially the ones towards the end. Oh my goodness, they're so pretty. And down below um, in the description box, you can use my link um, to order these as well. So let me know which one your favorite is. Again, this is Enamored. There's 12 polishes. So next up is Precious. It's best described as an orchid mauve purple infused with a hint of micro rose gold flakes. So beautiful. You can definitely layer these up a bit more. Um, even on my natural nails. This one is one of the fake press on nails. Um, I found that they build very well. You only need two coats um, most of the time. And even some you can get away with one. So it's really awesome. Next up we have Eleanor, it can be described as a dark cinnamon mahogany in a crushed velvet finish. This one is absolutely beautiful. It reminds me of chocolate, um, like a really cinnamony, awesome chocolate. It's beautiful. All right, so here is Lennon. It's described as a deep Pacific teal with a shimmering holographic finish. And wow, does this polish um, have holographic shimmers in it. It is beautiful when it hits the sunlight. It's amazing. I'm so excited about this one. And teal shades are so perfect for fall. All right, so next up we have Jean. It's described as a rich indigo periwinkle with a shimmering holographic finish. If you know me, I love my purples and this is definitely up there for me to wear. It's beautiful and it's got all the holographic shimmers in it when it hits the light as well. I am so excited because it pairs very well with some of these other purples in this collection. So super excited for this one. Alright, next up we have Venus. It's described as a vibrant and sparkling rose red with a shimmering holographic finish. This red is going to be so much fun for Christmas as well um, because it's holographic, of course. You get all those beautiful shimmers, so you're going to get so many great manicures with this one. And obviously perfect for fall too because apples, hello, the. All right, next up is Pamela, described as a darkened imperial, imp <laughs> is a darkened imperial purple cream. This one, oh my goodness, is hitting all the right spots with me. This one and the next ones coming up are beautiful.
Next up is Brinley, described as an intense mulberry cream with a hint of magenta undertones. These are the ones that I'm talking about, guys, that are going to be amazing matte, like I said. And Mar oh, and these polishes, Water Marvel, like you can't imagine. It is so great, and I'm excited. Um, yeah. Oh, you're going to love them, believe me. All right, so this one is Vera. Best described as an enticing bright mulberry cream. So this is a mulberry just like the one before but totally different. So this one I love. It's a bit lighter and it's just a nice complementing color to the other ones. So next up we have Brianna. It's described as a sophisticated toasted pink cream. This one, and like the other ones, you can do a Skittle manicure um, or, be or better known as a gradient manicure. That was huge um, a few months ago and I still love the idea of it. It's beautiful and something simple to do with your nails and fast and easy. So if you can't do nail art, at least you can like spice up your nails with, you know, like a gradient or whatever. Um, each nail is a different color, going light to dark, dark to light, if you didn't know what that was. So, yeah, it's beautiful. And last from this collection, it's the 12th one, it's Twinkleette. Best described as a glamorous rose gold holographic infused with micro pink shimmer. So I think if we lighten this up a bit, you can put it on top of the other polishes and it would be absolutely beautiful. But again, you can build this one up. The holographic just shines like crazy and it is beautiful. This one complements so many of the, um, of the shades. I love it together. You can do like your one accent nail with this. Just use a sponge and get some of the glitters out. Beautiful. So let me know what you guys think. These are all beautiful. The link's down in the uh, description box. Have a good day. Bye.